guys welcome to my channel my name is Christine I'm so excited today to show you a layout setup of a single room because I lived in two single rooms my my first single room was a, was a big a spacious one but it was not in a very good place so guys you can start from somewhere and move on to another place and don't be discouraged you can make it beautiful that place was 3,000 Kenya shillings per month and it was not that beautiful but I really made um, an effort of making it beautiful with the little I had because that time I was a student I want to take myself back if I went back to the same place what would I do different I want to show you how that room looked like for you so that you can be inspired to do that so basically this was the layout of my single room there's one door and one window so i've just tried to put every furniture where it should be and also making it very functional for anyone who is in a small space make everything functional so you will see it in a clearer picture so here you can see the kitchen space i have a cooker a fridge floating shelves and a cabinet where you can put your gas cylinder also for the shelves you can see i've put two with baskets for your extra shopping and also you can put cups plates and any other thing that you need for the kitchen you can see i've hung the cut rally there and on the cabinet you can you can also put your souffleurs and anything else you need if you don't have a standalone cooker you can use like a mac or any anything else you use to cook it's still okay so this side you can see i have the couch the coffee table and in front of it there is a tv and behind the couch you can see there is um wardrobe to put your clothes uh, so that you don't hang clothes where i see people hanging clothes on the on the wall because this way it looks better and it's not overwhelming on the eye so you can see this side after the bed there is a desk that is floating and a chair and of course in front of it there is a um, wall art where you can put your maybe your calendar your to-do list and there is a lamp there to enable you work comfortably in this single room so this is what i could totally do if i was working at home or if i was a student you can see clearly down there there is a uh, a laundry basket for you to put also your dirty clothes so that uh, you don't have a lot of clothes hanging or placed everywhere to keep this uh, place neat above the bed i've put this mirror to just reflect the light and also to elevate that part of the bed and on this side you can see the mirror the tv and the plant to just make this uh, wall interesting and not just so bare i've also mounted this tv to leave room for some uh, some few decors and guys this is the view from the window it's so beautiful so you can see this beautiful couch and behind it is a um, uh, entryway table and on top of it i've just put a key and most of the time entry tables are for dropping keys maybe picking masks and you will see this uh, console table has some drawers to put your knickknacks if you need that and i've also decorated it to just uh, make it beautiful and this is the view you see when you first enter on the bed uh, uh, wall there is this beautiful gallery and it's stunning and i've used the black frames to tie in the blacks on the console um, legs the, the chair the tv stand the tv to just balance all the blacks i've used uh, black uh, picture frames so even if you're in a small single room just use a big gallery and it will elevate that place it will make it so beautiful and this is the view you see you can see everything is at its place there is uh, space for passage even if you have many people some people can sit at the end of the bed others on the on the couch and others maybe can stand if you're too many anyway 
I hope uh, this really will inspire you because it's a beautiful design and if you live in a single room you can do this yourself there's nothing you're lacking you have everything that you need in a room for you to survive so um, you can see this view and I have everything put in this room what you may really need I did this for you because I know single rooms can be very tricky if you're starting out maybe you don't have anything you can set a budget and decide this month I'm buying this this month I'm buying things and make sure you get quality things because uh, these things you can pass them to even a one bedroom if you move out you can pass them to a bed sitter so buy very quality things because even if you're not uh, moving with them to the next place you can sell them i hope you really benefited if you benefited share this video with someone maybe your friend that can benefit them thank you so much guys barikiweni i love you so much bye